I literally just heard someone. Good kills, good shit. Shit, 1v2, yo. Yeah. Top me, top me, top me! What's in our spawn after that? In our spawn after that. That kid in our spawn, accuracy. He's got a bow. I had to push up into me. You got this, yo. Your host, too. Do you want? Oh. That was him, that was a kid in our spawn. Last kid was top three. Top three, yeah. Oh my god, dude! Uh, <laughs> You're the best, Huke! <laughs> this kid just won the fucking boredom. The nail biters, but denial is just proving their worth here as a squad. They're I mean, about it's to a knock out team. Stick, man. It is. It's not a steak. Well, no, uh, it's not a steak. Yeah. Oh yeah. my goodness, though. But it yeah. is delicious, baby. Double <laughs> kills coming in from no. Luke. Don't do Oh! Oh! Send them home! Send them That's home! That's the way to send them home. My goodness. Folks at home who saw that shot. Woo! Just and I are standing at that. That kid, the whole crowd is, buddy. Oh my goodness. That's Hook the Duke right there, baby. Oh, I like it. Throughout the entire course of it. But I always forget. Then when Sharp gets back on land, he starts to crush. We get Big Daddy Sharp, not Mr. Kentucky Online Internet Bullets Not Registering Sharp. Yeah, that's what we're seeing here. Actually, Hugh able to break that hill with a nice three-piece. He's on a five streak of his own. Now, the Sentinel squad, which is Carnage, still down by 70 seconds. A six-kill streak now. Hugh, the 15-year-old prodigy, now on a seven streak. He is just coming on fire right now. Yeah, you know, all I've heard about this guy is Beast, Beast, Beast. He's one of those names, you know, with every new title, you have a couple names that kind of pop up early on. Wow. Uh, players that you didn't really hear too much about as he continues to shred at an eight streak now. I think I'm starting to understand all the hype around him. Yeah, you can see he's just holding down these areas, not missing shots. Nine streak, stop that, Hugh. You're going a little bit he too He finally man. gets shut down. Oh, they do not stop him. CLG is looking to turn this around. Denial only needed three points. Can he finish this kill bottom middle? Yes, wow. he does. There is still time. Denial needs to regroup for one last good push. Snake bite and lethal falling. That's three down. This is all. Denial as Hook again. Bottom center. Locking it down with Contra. The double. The Hook chant. The victory here in three, two, one. Hook had some clutch plays to finish the game off right there. Rocky start from him in the first two games, but definitely... It goes down, and it's going to be the guys from Stunner who have control. Yes, yeah, Stunner couldn't be happier with where they're set up right now. They were getting that back spawn there outside of school. Now, though, it looks like Optic Gaming has flipped it. They're going to be pushing here through this back street side. Hugh able to pick up one. Will he spot any other players here? He does see Nature. Oh! Another, a three-piece there for Hugh. Absolutely massive play, just shutting down the Optic Gaming push. They went for the rotate, trying to get that spawn, as you said. Cukes said, no, 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 no coming in. Their main slayer, they're really losing a lot of that raw gun skill around right. the OG base. And you see Huke is just going to be on top of this green plot, waiting patiently above his own flag. And, oh, hello, one play to the left-hand side. It's going to be Scumpy. Scumpy dashes away. Huke does pick up the kill. However, there's going to be more players up to gaming. You're going to flood it. Can Huke pick up the second kill? Yes, he can. Looks for the third. Gets the kill on Crim6. And that's what we're talking about, Matt. It may not be, a, like, uh. the best strategy, but he just does it so well. Sometimes you just throw strategy out the window. I mean, that was pretty <laughs> ridiculous. Uh. Very static and sitting in one place. He's going to just open up certain sight lines for himself to pick up a kill. But, wow, Huke. Look at that kill, a perfect kill with the carbine. And that was Pistola. Something interesting could happen. If Hook can get into the EG base and pick up a kill here with this camo as he's crouching all the way over, he spots Lunchbox. Lunch or Suspector didn't even see him. He's going to get the return. Just trying to stay alive. Goes, oh my, <laughs> are you kidding? Oh, do it, do it. Go. We're going to win this. We're going to open things up with Huke from Aware, and he is going to be making his way straight to the hard point. First one in, gets that capture. Now he's going to be running around the map looking for his first lane. We're going to throw on COD Vision for you to show you where the opponents are coming from. Those red outlines are the phase players trying to jump in, and already Huke opening up with two kills, accuracy with two of his own, and TJ already on that objective. Huke's going to have a couple more kills there. That's one, that's two. Nicely played from him. Looking for the third, turns over towards mid-cut, and his teammate's going to clean that up nicely. Oh, wow, off to a great start. 15 to 1. Of course, his first hill on Hardpoint Solo, but you're not really expected to pick up a lot of time, but if, if a wacky gun like this, they're going to get every second. Essential. Now, look at the mini-map. Oh, and please stop. Oh. Huke, six streak already. Yeah, so 6 and 0. Oh. Not a bad start <laughs> from Huke. <you. laughs>
What a ridiculous. Oh, top yellow the misses the jump though. Tries, I think, toss it into window, but he is eventually going to fall. We have Hugh. He knows there's two players in and around here, able to win that nice gunfight. Great move from him. He does have a oh, the melee. Hops in the window, and he has. Is he home free? Oh, there's the dunk. that's a play and a half right there wow. coming from Hugh. Nicely done. That makes it an 11 to 7 game. Still in favor of Optic Gaming. Huke now starting to slay out. However, Nature did have the drone. He's going to fall. If you can continuously start killing and spawn trapping plays over from this green side, aware we'll be able to start rappling, or sorry, rattling in these relays like we saw Optic Gaming do at the start of the second side. Right there. Oh my gosh. Hook just kicking things off extremely well already with a beautiful snipe. I mean, this is what. This is what we see him do with the sniper. We saw him on Eden just with the 11 snipers. I, I wouldn't be surprised if we saw something again. Every guy that he sees, it's just no a connection no. of every headshot. Are you kidding me? A triple kill. We are going to have to get the replay on that. Thank goodness he didn't get the overkill right. I mean, you can't say anything that Denal's really done effective on this hard point game. I mean, they haven't gotten kills, haven't rotated on time. She's been looking really off in this first hardpoint game. Yeah, I don't know if it's just uh, starting to get a little late, if it's a lack of energy, if they didn't warm up properly, but they have oh. definitely started slow here, and they've got to get it going because the young guys <laughs> of Aware are just melting as Hook continues to crush. I mean, Hook just absolutely dominating this ice area. You see everybody over on Denal, they're going to... Uh, from Aware, honestly, they're all around even, a little negative, but they kept up for the most part in the slaying department considering they had the bad side to start. And they get three huge kills right off the break there. They're going to have one more player in lobby. It's going to be Hugh leading the charge with that bow. He's going to try and take out replays. Phenomenal shots. And it's going to be accuracy. He's going to be running this flag down. Poolside Hook is absolutely lighting it up right here. He's going to pick up another one in front of him. He is starting this second half off hot on a five streak. And I think he was able to get the flag carrier there right before Hook cleaned him up. But here is going to come the cap. I do not Instantly. think that's 20 seconds left of the clock. They're not going to have time. I don't uh, think I mean, they, they get one. They have the pull. They have the pull. Actually, take it out. back. They do have the pull. Shots coming in behind. He needs covers from his teammates. That grenade, Happy actually stuns them both. Happy gets a three piece. That's so big. He's got 10 seconds. He's home free. There's nobody there. He can get it in. Wow. As soon as I saw that flag pulled, you saw Happy. He was just kind of waiting on the Whoa. other side of pool wall, and he was lit up on the mini map for a reason. He was able to pick up those three kills from behind fairly easy. Well, you could tell how the reason I think he'd be able to get it in is because Hugh was taking fire. You saw he was moving so yeah. slow. He was getting shot in the back. All he had time to really do was turn and toss that grenade at the top of the wall. I think that stun I, I, basically... I even think if he didn't get that stun off, I think they would have scored that. Well, everyone dropping right now mid-street and Skull. Huke in the window here, able to get one. I think he saw one jump over the wall as well to his left. That was called out. He should be able to flank this player here. Going to be able to pick up an easy second. Another one out the window. He saw it again as he goes over the wall, pre-fires it, and just great awareness right now uh, from Hook. Yeah, you know, who's playing absolutely phenomenal the entire series. You're going to need the rest of the players, though, on the team to step up. And he is actually going in right now. He He's moving around, looking around to find these players, but it's gotten a little bit quiet, though. That's right now. Finds a player. Those are going to pick up that one. Maybe turn the scatter for two. Yes, indeed. Top Gun killing Frenzy has not yet died. Goes for the bounce. Will he hit it? Oh, yes, indeed. The triple my. kill with the double bounce of the scatter. My goodness. Players, yeah, they may need to overcome a... Uh, a mental block, maybe, once you're at a, a live event, just because there's a lot of eyes watching, and you've got... Oh, no! <laughs> shooter! Oh, man. Luke just destroyed Please get Shooter a replay right there. Of that. Please get a replay. Fly in here. You see Haley. He's got one across. That's Hook flying in. Picks up one teammate, and Hook gets a massive two-piece. How did he even pick up both of those There kills? are only a few players in Call of Duty you can make a play like that. That just looked ridiculous from his point of view. Yeah, that was just silly. Hook... Starting to go on a little bit of a spree here. Make it three, oh, three, make it four. He's going to pick up that fourth player. It's going to be 27 seconds left on this hill. Now oh, he's going to start he oh, going. My. That six, he had one more outside. So tagged up that he's eventually going to fall. You need Slasher to show up. I mean, when Slasher plays the way we're used to seeing him playing at previous events, I mean, he can AR with the best of them. I mean, you put him right in the conversation with Formal and Glacer, but right now, just getting outbound by Formal. Hook doing a nice job trying to lock down this mid bio. Oh, Picking man. up three huge kills. So aggressive. He get the fourth, gets him weak, not going to challenge it, but. And I would say down on the bottom, that fourth heal. That's the other one that you're going to be looking at to take a ton of time on. Phase able to break it. Still reasonably early in the hill, but it looks like Envy going to be flooding from all angles. Hook on your screen, going to be just watching the back. But it looks like all the pressure going to be coming from the front. Proof picking up a big two piece. Hook, last one alive for Phase near the hill. Going to have to try and make something happen. As a player in front of him, going to get an assist. Now he's going to back down. I do not. 
I don't know how he's still alive up here. He's going to be able to take out that one player. Now going to push back into the hill. Just a fantastic play by Hoot. Just so much patience right there, David. Yeah, he makes it look so, so easy. Stays alive. And they, they were at, at risk there of trailing by 30 or 40 points going into this next hard point. But they basically brought it back to even by him staying alive. Like I said, he was last alive for quite a while there. Able to give his teammate, teammates a reasonable spawn. They were able to rotate back and give it one more attack with, I think, about 20 seconds left in that hard point as they brought it back. And here's a lead change. It's going to be... Face back in control here. Hook's still alive. I feel like this guy runs out of ammo for in his bow pretty much every single time he spawns. Yeah, like cur that. currently on a five streak. Make it six. Hook absolutely starting to turn up here. At XMs, he's going to have one player directly in front of him, not going to be able to connect with those shots. But you know, when he gets going, he is so fun to watch. I mean, just some of the best movement in all Call of Duty, and he's so patient, so smart for such a young player. Two down for Team Liquid. He gets some hit takes. Can he finish them? That's going to be the sword player. Rain is down. A player is pink one trying to get that camo. I believe that camo is burned, but yep. Hook picks up a triple kill. Can he get the over? He's going to go for it. Yes, he Ooh. does get the overkill. And the most fragile of leads, Envy, are up only by... Oh, my goodness. Let me stop talking and acknowledge that ridiculousness. Rain, you thought different, my man. You were going to go for the challenge. Instead, you came... Side. That's going to be Eco trying to push onto that blue band. Players trying to get alive. Get ready for this overshield. Oh, it doesn't oh, get it. No, he does not. Triple kill for Hook. What a play out of him. And he has control yet again. Envy, they get. Yeah, we actually saw Denial. Got the early rotation there, but oh. Neslo came in. He was a little disruptive, but it doesn't even matter. Hook's going to come in, stomp him out. 13 and 8 right now, sitting in school, or the yellow window, helping the squad out here. He's not. He's actually sitting in this corner just pre-firing because he knows that when he steps out, Perfectly he's going to be taken out. But that two-piece right there, Hook played that corner so oh, well. Hook is just showing why he is considered one of the strongest slayers in all of AW knowing that the push is going to continue from TK from that back trailer area, pre-firing, hopping up and down, doing whatever he can to stay alive. There you can see he continues to cut down the players from TK time and time again. Except expect to see Temp and Slasher up against Clayster and Enable with the Bows in the blue and purple area. Going to be so crucial to hold down that spot. Nobody's gone for drone control yet. There's almost been a minute gone. Hook now trying to do some work just to hold them off. He doesn't want to give them any control. He goes with a quick stop. Does oh. manage to pick it up as well. Fantastic work by him to deny drone control. Fire for his team. Not picking up too many kills, but he will get these players weak. That's two down for LG. And they are able to get control of bottom mid once again. You're down by 15. Cool. Hook's pushing up, making sure that he's going to block off this route right here. Getting this player down to one shot. Can he make it happen? Yes, he does. Hook, you hear the fans <laughs> in the crowd. Chanting Hook. Hook still alive. 40 to 50 now. Only down by 10. Snipe down. Lifting up. He's going to have help by Hook. Great teamwork and great communication by these two. For denial there. And again, uh, you see they're trying to get themselves back into this. But going into that last hill, uh, it is going to be only a five point differential. Oh and look at God. denial. Hook's able to pick up two. Tent's going to get the next two. And denial wins their first rotation. Difference here. Chances they did go into that rotation first. And not only that, but big plays from Hook and Tent to lock it down. And so far, they're getting the points back. Classic it's going to be in a great position to shut it down. One more play. It's Hook. Hook will go to take him down at the same time. And Hook has actually turned it around. He might be able to grab the spawns for his team here. And he has. Now, can he continue on this rampage? Gets in. It's his third kill at the same time. Pushes through green. And he single-handedly changed the fortune for his squad. Yeah, without oh a doubt. Going to be on the five streak as he completely turns on Slack there. Going to be winning every single gunfight that he's got in for this life. Of course, replays, though. Able to pick up two. And Hook still has been able to milk every single second of this hill time. They have now had the biggest lead that they've had this entire game by nearly 30 points and of course you see all of those red arrows just spawning so far away and again they have to get through that original defensive line just to go run into an angry cube yeah i mean that was just ridiculous there that's his sixth kill in a row look at tj halley backing off before he gets taken down and he's now going to be challenged and tj halley will eventually for hook so we'll see if that needler is going to come to use here in the halo world championship finals what a play yes Hoops, he's got the needler he's going for the kill does he get it yes. Yes, he, for the killing frenzy hook with the needler kill he is still going the crowd chanting hook he is not dead yet <laughs> 10 kill spree we are witnessing history from this man right now and he drops the weapon after pulling off the killing friends that just showed on the map, so he was desperate right there. One of the members of the goes to the bottom of the base. Pistola sacrifices his life 
to put in that tying flag. We have a tie game here. 53 seconds. No! Oh, who comes in with the triple and the reversal? Clears Optic out the base. Dave, we've got another flag on the run. Blaze comes to help him out, but not going to be enough. Rise able to get a break, and it took him all 10 seconds. Hook now beginning to lead the charge for Denials. They go for the retake. 20 seconds left on this final hard point of the first rotation. They don't want to just give up all this time for free. Spots one player, puts some shots down on him. That's Burns who falls. Oh my Picks God. up the second kill as well on the struggling Chino. Nice plays from Hookler. Let's just say Hook dropped 45 kills in a 2v2 hard point on this map. He was going absolutely off. Right now it's reflecting in this game. He's leading his team in regards to score. Slasher is right there with him as well. That duo is just so strong. The three piece make it four from Hook. Kyler is waking up on this early Saturday morning. Oh, that kid is just absolutely terrifying. He's, you can he's see, the man, yeah, dude. Flooding he's awesome. him back. He just picked up four. They know where he has to be pushing from. He's just in that area. And still, uh, Ryze doing everything they can just to contest and not let that score get any closer than it needs to be because there's only 10 seconds left on this hill. But Yuke is just destroying. And uh, let, me, let me point something out for you. For viewers at home that hate when casters use the word consistent, look at the likes of what Apathy does and what he can drop. He can have some of the biggest plays. He can do some of the craziest things but then some games he'll drop double negative like he did last night against optic gaming who is always on top of the scoreboard he's putting on shows like this as he chases down his seventh kill on this streak now 18 and 8 that is what makes kyler such a dominant submachine gun player rockets and if he could take down the flag player he could maybe even get a return not, not like this just firing rockets into the base and finding faces that one player's got to be tagged up at least Looking for this last player. Rocket goes down. Whiffs one. Oh, Whiffs a no. second. Uh-oh. Hook says, get the hell out of here, Lunchbox. This is my flag. Jab that is Hook that's going to go off and break it. You talked about how big those injury kills are. And that's four straight. Oh that's five God. with the melee. And this may be the oh, it's six through green. This might be the chance for the comeback right now. Hook is going off. He is an insane type player, especially when you're finding him in the air. You can't even keep up. <laughs> I don't know, his aerial combat is unlike anything I've ever seen. Game now, only 57 seconds left in this game, and look at Hugh already winning those gunfights. Yep. He's able to pick up he two. He got Parasite exactly. with the first man rotating yeah. as well, which was huge, and he gets a second, so that's just gigantic there. And there comes a bottom spawn as well, so the man in the hard point, I got him highlighted. That is going to be temp. That should seal the game. Yeah, that's your game without a doubt. And what an interesting game as well, because when we look at Denial, normally Slasher is always putting up numbers. Every single like every single time, very consistent, doesn't get in the hill much, but he does his job to a oh, T. God. But Aqua, with the sniper rifle, there was three hills throughout the entire game where Slasher just couldn't get anything to work from distance oh, because God. players kept getting picked off. So next with anyone, Temp and Hoop now pushing in. Hoop will get control of the hill. Can he try and make a play here, though? He's going to be all by himself, completely isolated. Face plays running towards him. He actually picks up a kill on Clay. That's big. Clay with that battle up top. Would have been slaying down his teammates, and Hook has just made a, a big, big play. Hook and his movement. He's able to stay alive almost longer than any other player. We would have seen somebody else in this is position so just run out and challenge. He's going to pick up a few kills. Currently on a five streak, going to start to rotate, and he's actually going to go back through the yellow tunnel. He's going to try and defend this with one in my eyes because he just gave away his position instantly. Right there, they knew there was a camel player over towards Blue Catwalk. And look at this play from no. Hook. Gets oh the stick, my. gets the double kill. What a play. My word. Jumps upon the ledge, is passive for a second, sticks one player, finishes off the second. Hook, you absolute little beauty. It's going to be your man, the hard point. He has one right now. Going to get peak from, I believe, bottom door in steps. He will be taken out as their advantage here starting to grow. Every time we go on with Hook, you see how he's just up in the air playing that vertical game. It's something that Elevate hasn't played against. I mean, obviously, <laughs> besides the series against Denial earlier, but today they haven't played. Nope. OG likes to stay on the ground more. Hook gave the, gives them some trouble sometimes yeah, with the verticality, absolutely. but... Now, Look at him. He's going against him. They can't find him. I mean, they can't track this guy down. Unbelievable play. Yeah. Just jumps over another one. They cannot Wild. even put shots in him. He's like a little jackrabbit just hopping around. Who coming up with play after play? 22 and 16 on a five streak, leading his team in captures as well at seven. Four minutes left to go. He's going to end up following, <laughs> but Temp will be in the hard point. What a run there we saw from who? That, that just goes to show how special of a player he is. But a lot of confidence earlier on in the day. An unbelievably sick two-piece snipe in that S&D. And from there, he definitely looked as if he just massively improved. Hoop, though, picking up a three-piece, looking for the fourth. Will finally fall. And it's going to be 10. 49. And Denal starting to climb. Hotpoint will be contested on board with Hook. Can he find the second? Yes, he wow. can. Nice play from him. Third place going to be pushing in. Hook with a three-piece. Looking for four. Hook not going to be able to connect. Let's go, Hook.
Hook doing so much damage. Temp right there with him inside the hill. We're moving in 10 seconds to now gonna try and milk every last one here. Hook is gonna be left. Calls it out that there's a player inside. Great help coming in. That time it was Temp. And you'll see his teammate Slashers down low. Classics win. No, he deletes to block silo spawns. I don't know how Hoop got over there. Where did this man come from? He just clutched it. Uh, that was a, in Triple. my opinion, guaranteed oh, no. oh, oh, oh. Oh, 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 oh. oh, man. Extermination. Second time ghost. The slams right now from both of these teams. What a wild game. Yeah, this is, uh, I mean, it's the best players in the world competing. And there's a reason that they're hitting these shots. And then, of course, he somehow pulls out the double kill. Three down now as straight Rippin are all dead with Ace going down. They're going to spawn at Silo, who cutting off that choke point already. Look at these nades coming in, trying to stop that flag grab. That overextend. Hines gets taken down. And look at how he manages these choke points. Wham, bam, thank you, man. There you have it. Team Envy as they put one in the bag. That takes us up to two to one in favor of straight Rippin. We did say before how good Envious is at turning a oh, game man. on its head. Jumps up, pings Renegade in the face. Down he goes. Another oh, player. Man. One, two, reversal. Thank you very much. Get the hell out of here, Hyde. Oh, there's no. another Not triple. Again. Please don't do Baby it Baby killing dude. frenzy. Hook. You can hear the crowd going wild. Flags in. We're all drawn up to a piece. Oh. <laughs> it is 2-2, two, two, and it just happened just like that. As you said, two caps went to straight ribbon in the first two minutes. Well, the next two were all envious, and I mean, really all who This guy is on fire. Somebody stop him. My God. I think we're on an 11 kill streak right now. Second railgun is up. Can he bag the second one for the second time? Excuse me, third railgun even. Oh, no. Finally. Finally. The wow. Damn. It's the